Okay. When you open it up, what you want to do is peel your paper. Hold your thumb on this cardboard to the trap. And as you pull, pull slowly and hold this really tight so you don't pull the staples out. If you do pull the staple out from here, then just take a regular staple gun and just re-staple the staple gun. So as you get all this here pulled off and your whole paper off, what you'll do at that point is lift these up because you want the snake to be able to go through a gap or a little hole like that. Okay, so there's the finished product look. Okay, so this here you might want to have two people or something, but you want to just lift this up. Make sure this stays at a 90 degree angle before this touches the glue. So you'll lift this up, right? Get that up. Get these centered of where you want to put them. And then stick them. Now this, this will stick to the glue. This will stick to the glue. That's a good opening for a snake to come in. This is at a 90 degree angle. Okay? Once those two stick, you're going to close your lid and then you'll bend these down, put these in where you want them, hold these with your thumb, again making sure this stays at a 90 degree angle and then hold them in your thumb, peek on the inside to make sure you have a good drop and then as soon as both sides are ready, drop it on the glue board trying to make this drop even with the bottom. And then, because once you drop it, if you don't pay attention and you drop it sort of kind of crooked like that, it's stuck. You have to pour vegetable oil to loosen it off, and then you're going to ruin the glue board. So have two people sort of kind of help you. One person can hold this side maybe like this. One person can hold this side. But then as soon as it glues itself together, becoming together, then your finished product, of course, should sit and look like that. That way the snake can go on the inside there, maybe two 45 degree angles, 90 degrees all the way around, and then two 45 degree angles. And then once it's glued, it'll stay. Now when you catch a snake, you can just come in here and pour vegetable oil in the sides. He'll wiggle himself free. When he takes off, then you can take these and sort of kind of wiggle it back and forth and you'll break it free with vegetable oil Right, once you open it back up, you'll be back to this point, tear off your old glue board with the vegetable oil, throw it away, and then buy more glue boards, staple them on. This is, of course, plastic, will last you forever. The glue boards are replaceable. Because while catching the snake, you may catch some lizards or something, leave the lizards on there, it can act like bait, or mice, it can act like bait where the snake will come to eat the lizard or the mouse and get stuck. That's it.